Hi everyone, so this is Doctor Who Season 2 Episode 1, Part 1 of the Dalek Invasion of Earth. Now I am having a little sneaky watch of this while I'm on my lunch break, um, so I won't delay, I'll get straight on into it. Please do excuse my lunch. Excuse me what? I've just seen the sign! <laughs> So okay, are we in the future? Is it the present? This is really depressing already. Oh bloody hell, talk about bad timing. The man's just killed himself and then you turn up. What has gone wrong? Well Doctor, where are we now? Now we're nice and quiet I hope. Oh yes, let's have a holiday. Take a look for yourselves. <laughs> well I can't see anything. Neither can I. Well, it looks like moving water to me. It might be a river somewhere. I don't know. <laughs> What's the reading, Susan? Radiation I'm guessing it's the Thames. Oxygen normal. Oh. Well, we made it. We're here. Well, there we are. Back home. Your planet. <laughs> you brought us a long way around, Doctor. <laughs> More by good luck than judgment. Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> Probably Sunday. Don't tell me. I wonder which year we've landed. What was that, Doctor? Mm, oh, I, uh, I was just wondering about the time factor, my boy. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Probably Sunday. Make much difference to us, you know. Well, I hope for both your sakes it's nearly your time, but bear in mind we might have landed in the early 1900s. Oh. Look at all this neglect all over the place. We've been abandoned, all of it. <laughs> it was a mess with construction work, Doctor. Welcome to uh, London. Perhaps, perhaps. Oh, come on, Doctor, stop spoiling everything. Oh, my dear, I believe you me, I wouldn't spoil your homecoming for all the world. <laughs> I still can't see much. Well, there's not a sign of any people, anyway. Did it break the TARDIS? The ship, just The ship! Susan. It's going to be very difficult. But remember, we're in London. Well, what's that got to do with it? Well, it's, it's the people, they're all be curious. They want to know why we're trying to break into a police box. Yes. Hmm? They don't ask what a police box is doing under a bridge in the first place. Yes, exactly. <laughs> you know, it's primarily this girder. You were right, you need a cutting flame. I know one thing for sure, Doctor. We'd better make sure we can get back into the ship before we start looking around. Just in case there's trouble. It's intelligent. Hmm. That's good. Hmm. Easily. You haven't seen anyone? Heard? Well, what have we heard? Hmm. Nothing. Precisely nothing. No sound of bird song, no voices, no sound of shipping. Not even the chimes of old Big Ben. It's uncanny. Mm. Uncanny. Well, can't we all go? Well, how's your ankle, Susan? I'll try it. It's <laughs> not uh. very good, is it? Gosh, it's awfully swollen. I'm sorry, Barbara. Oh, <clears throat> are there going to be like zombies or something in the river? Or. Babs will shoot off, a Dalek will come, Susan. Go on. Hello, sweetheart. You tell it. London. It isn't like this. The river's too quiet and there's no sound of traffic. There's a strange poster on the wall back there. It just doesn't make sense. Well, off we go again. I'm sorry, Barbara. Is it selfish to want us all to stay together? <coughs> going to be like some people hiding. Wait, there we go. It's Battersea Power Station. What's happened to those two chimneys? Mm, what's happened to London, dear boy, is more to the point. <laughs> uh, 
must have gone over to nuclear power. This is it. Well, at least we know the century, dear boy. Look. 2164. Is it a dead body? Oh. Me and the girl? Tyler's got her. Now come on, we've got to get out of here. Quick, follow me. What, Bob's Wait. want? Yes, 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 yes. yes, yes. He knows what that is. He's dead. Hmm? Why was he in the box? What is this? Well, there's some sort of adornment, but... What for? Is it yeah. how the Daleks are controlling people by these helmets? Be some sort of medical aid, Doctor. You know, if he'd fractured his skull, something to knit the bones together. No, I think there's something more to it than that. Someone coming? Was he murdered? Hmm. Hmm. Watch your step a bit, Ian. No one can get through that way. Where's the man though? Where's where's the man who was with her? You might want to keep up the pace, Babs. Quickly now. Are they in the underground? The we'll do the best we can. <laughs> oh, well, it's, uh, it might have been something to do with that gunfire we heard across the river. Yes, I suppose they might have hidden somewhere. Yeah, let's wait and see. Hmm? I have a feeling waiting Body. is going to be the bad thing to do. I'll get back. Tyler? Yes. And who have we got here? I've had a couple of them down by the river. Open targets. Well, we didn't know. I suppose you didn't. But you know, these have got a couple of friends down there they want us to bring back. Well, I didn't see anyone there except that I was nearly caught by a couple. They didn't go into the old warehouse, did they? That's opposite the old power station. Yes, I think they did. Yeah, and I thought they were enemies. Tyler! Where have you been? What the devil have you been doing? You've landed a saucer at the heliport. Saucer? Right. What attack plans? Why are you sitting down? I've hurt my ankle. What attack plans? Come on, Tyler, get these people. He's like, out. sort it out. That's a way. I'll stay here on watch. Doctor! Doctor, come and have a look at this. Hmm? What? Look. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> well, read it, read it. Well, I repeat it, stupid. Stupid place to put a poster. My that's near murder. Mate, the mm -hmm. Thames is full of them. That's what they did here. during the plague. They threw them mm. in the river. Plague? There they are. It must be them. Ah. Anyway, let us go further afield. Come along, come along. Now, I suggest you, if you go up that way, then I go... Oh, they're surrounded. When I give the word, turn and dive in the water. Well, I 
actually really enjoyed that. I thought it was quite a good little setup episode for this story. Um, I believe there are six parts to this one, um, but I actually really enjoyed that. It was nice not having the protagonist in the story from the get-go and it was a good little build-up of kind of can you trust these people do you think and, and things like that so I really really enjoyed that so um, hopefully part two shouldn't be too far behind this one and I'll see you soon thank you